Here's two ways how to get GPT-4 free without ChatGPT+. OpenAI ChatGPT-4 was released recently, but hey, why would you even want to use this new GPT model? Well, it has some game changer improvements, which you'll see later in the video. Remember to hit the subscribe button and tap the notification bell so you don't miss out on more AI videos like this. But for now, let's get straight into the video. Here's how to use OpenAI ChatGPT for free with Poe.com. So yeah, come to Poe.com and then continue with a Google account. For those that don't know, Poe is a platform where you can engage with AI powered bots and get instant responses for your queries, allowing for interactive exchanges. And you can see the list of different chat bots that are linked with Poe. We can see we've got the original chat GPT, so you could go ahead and use that. But then up the top here, you can see GPT-4. So let's click that. Now it does say limited access. You are limited to one ChatGPT4 free prompt per day, which is only really useful for a quick on the fly request. So there's a result from GPT-4. We can see we've got zero messages left today and it says we can subscribe to support Poe and send more messages, but that remains to be seen. Also another limitation here is although we're using GPT-4, it says it does not have knowledge of events after 2021. The second method of using GPT-4 free doesn't have this limitation. So in a moment, I will show you the free and 100% unlimited method of how to use GPT-4 for free. First though, what is so good about GPT-4 anyway? Well, while GPT-3 and 3.5 only understands and works with text, OpenAI GPT-4 can also look at pictures and graphs. It can tell you what's in a photo or figure out what a graph is showing. It can even create captions for pictures, which is helpful for making educational materials or social media posts. This makes GPT-4 a powerful tool for creating and learning. Most notably though, GPT-4 can access current news and browse the live web. This is key for ensuring the answers to your prompts are as accurate as possible. So if you're serious about wanting to use ChatGPT-4, including its new ChatGPT plugins update, which you can learn how to use in this video right here, then get ChatGPT+. It will set you back 20 bucks US per month, but well worth it if you want to be on the front line of AI tech. But for those not wanting to fork out for ChatGPT+, here's how to get ChatGPT4 for free with Bing Chat AI. Yes, Bing Chat AI utilizes GPT4 for all of its answers. And there is now no wait list. There are a couple of hoops to jump through though, but once done, you have unlimited access to GPT4 free. To use the new Bing chat, head over to bing.com in any browser and tap chat. You'll get this message saying chat mode's only available when you have access to the new Bing. But as I said, there is no wait list and to unlock conversational search, you have to use Microsoft Edge, web browser app from Microsoft. So we'll go ahead and download that. I'm going to zoom through this Bing chat AI install process, but check out the video above if you want to see more detail on how to download and use Bing chat. Once installed, what you will need to do is sign into your Microsoft account. And if you don't have one, just set one up. It's nice and easy to do. So we'll skip through this real quick as well. Once installed, you can either go up to the try the new Bing today or just come over and click here. Great, we're in. Welcome to the new Bing. Let's click chat now. So here is the new Bing using GPT-4. And let's ask it this question. And here is the answer that yes, it is using GPT-4. It is missing a few features, but it is the only way to use GPT-4 for free at this time. Besides that other workaround, which I showed you before. Now check out this video to see how to use ChatGPT plugins with OpenAI ChatGPT-4. Also subscribe to the channel so you can get more AI updates as they happen. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.